Hi guys, so if you watched my last video already, um, I am wearing the same clothes and that is because I'm filming in like the same day because I'm just trying to get so many videos like filmed for you so they're easier to upload. So, um, now I'm going to film for you a balm and lush haul. If you don't know what balm or lush is, I expect you all know what lush is but if you don't know what balm is basically it's the same as lush and bath bombs the name balm um and stuff so i'm gonna do that for you today now i just want to do a quick point tell before i do this um the lush stuff are not in lush bags but are in little plastic bags that i have put them in because either i didn't want to film this video at the start or forgot I wanted to film this video and chug the little bags they come in away and put them in a little like tray which is what I always put them in um and yeah so they're in little plastic bags and I can't remember what they are called but I'll try my hardest to remember and if I can't find out I'll put and if I can find out for you I'll put them down below um, and at the end of this video, I'm going to show you how I organise my bath bums um, and make them all look pretty and stuff instead of them just being a, in a bag. So let's get started. So I'm going to start with the Lush things. I think I've got two of these. Three. Three. <laughs> um, so, oh, my face looks. There you go done um so i'm gonna get started the first one is in this little bag they're all in little orange little plastic bags as i said um and it's a cupcake and i love cupcakes it looks like this and i cannot actually remember what this one is called i think it's called like something like sweet as sweet as a cherry or something and it's just a plain white bath bum. And it's got like this icing stuff on and a cherry on the top. And it smells like coconut and cherries. That's how I would explain the smell. Oh, it smells good though. It smells good. And um, in this video, I'll probably all be saying, oh, that smells good or that is amazing. I'm not very good at <laughs> describing scents, so yeah, but this is what that looks like, and I think that was around £4 or £3.50 or something, and that's a very powdery one, so I expect that one crumbles really nicely in your bath. Um, next I got, oh my god, my lap, guys, is covered in this that powder now okay moving on the next one I got I cannot again remember what it's called I think it's something like upsy daisy <laughs> but this is a smaller bath bum and it's pink um and on the top I want to show you that because that's really cute but one of the daisies has fallen off. They've got little daisies. So it's a pink bath bomb. It's got a white specks on it. But it's a pink bath bomb. And it's got these three really cute, sweet little daisies. <clears throat> See, they keep falling out though. Now one of them's gone in the bag. Okay, I've got it fine guys um but they have three little flowers on and that's super cute and um, this smells such a floral scent if you like quite calming bath bombs this isn't the bath bomb for you it's quite like strong scent but it looks like this it's got quite a strong scent but I love that I love strong scents, especially floral scenting things, because they're just the best. And then the last thing I got is 
Mm, it's quite a big one. Oh, and I think that Upsy Daisy one, I think it's called, it was £2 or something. It's quite a cheap Beth Bam. So, that's good if you've got a price budget. Um, and then the last one is this one. This is a massive one. This is a bubble bar. It's massive. And it's like, size of like, almost half of my head. Oh my gosh. This smells so good. It's got a Vimto smell. And it's basically purple. And it's got like white swells in it. A hiccup. <laughs> but it smells so good. Oh, and I think this is around £6. Because again, this one's quite expensive. But it's because of how big it is. You can get about 6 goes out of this. But the ones that are like the cupcake and the upsy daisy one. You can only get one out of them, and that is because one, they're size, and two, it's a bath bomb, not a bubble bar. But bubble bars are more solid, and like you crumble it under running water, and it makes bubbles. Um, so I think that's around six pounds, I think. So now moving on to the things that I got from Bomb for Home Face. I got four things from Bomb. Um, and Balm don't do full size bath bombs while the one that I live by doesn't like the big ones like that I've just shown you they do smaller versions these bags are so noisy um, so I'm going to show you the one my nan bought me it's this one they come in a cute little bag it says Balm Cosmetics um, This is the one that my nan bought me and they're all like cupcakes so it's got like the bottom and then a frosting and it's just got white frosting and a pink bottom and then it's got a little broken love heart I th this used to be a full love heart but I can't remember where the other bit's gone but and then it's got little red sprinkles this again is quite a soapy smell, like the floral one that I just showed you. It's quite quite soapy smell, but it's super pretty and it's so delicate and elegant. It's not like strong. It smells nice. So I got that one off my nan, and these were three for six pounds or two pound each. So that's the one my nan got me. Um, and then I bought three. Um, I got this one which I thought was so cute. Um, as you know, I used to be addicted to superheroes and this just reminded me of that. It's got a, such a bright blue bottom and then it's got like this cream at the top again. And just a zap with gold stars. This smells like something I know the scent of. Cookie. It smells like a cookie. And that's super nice. And then the bottom of it melts. But the top is like, it's like icing. So it kind of dissolves like nicely, like slowly. But this is a fast melting bottom because it's like a bubble bar. Like a bubble mat, a bath melt. I'm lush. I got this one which I thought was cute because as you know ladybirds are my favourite animal after monkeys so I had to get this it's got a white bottom on with little strawberry pips in and then it's got again a white cream and then it's got a ladybird and a little leaf and again the bottom of it is quite a melting one it's melting in my fingers. So yeah, that's really cute. This smells like fruit pastels. Um, with a mix of soap. Oh, this looks sexy. With a mix of soap. And it's just so pretty scent. Oh my gosh. Mm. And then the last one I got is this one. This is a more of an all whipple. Like one. 
and it's got a whipple bottom and a whipple back it's like whipple whipple <laughs> um, and then on the front it's mostly white whipple and he's got a little duck this smells like what my nan's house smells like not my great nan my nan it's such a pretty scent Mm, and it smells like care. It smells like that thing that if you have had a hard day at work, you would put this in your bath. Mm, I love that scent. And then I did get one other thing from Lush that I'm going to show you, but I have already used it. It's another bubble bar, like the big Vimto one I showed you. Um, and it's this one. It's called Candy Mountain. And it smells like candy. And in my Lush, they've brought this out full time now. I know in most Lushes you can only get this at Christmas time. But it was doing so well in my Lush that you can buy this now full time. And basically it's pink. I just I got so excited to just spat a bit. Um, it's pink and white. And it smells so good. It smells like Vimto mixed with sweet pastels. Mm. And it smells good. And you crumble this again. It's like breaking up. You crumble it again. I've already used half of it. So yeah, so that's that. And that's everything. I know this video probably wasn't that interesting. But these are the bath bombs that I love. And if you go to a place where they sell these, you can probably smell them for yourself and love them. Like, I love them. Um, so, yes, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I love you all. Thank you for your support. And bye.